thing good morning students today we are going to discuss about the difference between spontaneous and stimulated emission in the context of in the context to laser so first difference is that spontaneous emission may be defined as emission in which an atom in excited state emits radiation by going from excited state to ground state in the absence of incident radiation whereas in case of stimulated emission in stimulated emission may be defined as emission in which atom in excited state emits radiation by going from excited state e2 to ground state e1 and it emits a photon of frequency nu whereas h nu is the energy of the photon in the presence of incident radiation here uh, a second difference is that you can draw the diagram in which atom goes from e2 to e1 by emitting one photon in case of spontaneous emission whereas uh, in case of stimulated emission atom goes from e2 to e1 by emitting two photons in the presence of incident photon right so just draw the diagram in uh, as a difference as a second point right so this is the second difference and third difference is that Uh, in case of spontaneous emission radiations emitted in spontaneous emission jumps in random directions and radiations are not coherent or incoherent in nature whereas in case of stimulated emission stimulated emission is coherent with incident stimulating radiation or you can say with stimulating incident radiation so uh, this is incoherent in nature uh, this spontaneous emission is incoherent in nature whereas stimulated emission is coherent in nature in case of stimulated emission light is uh, in case of spontaneous emission light is uh, polychromatic whereas in case of stimulated emission light is monochromatic and this is the another example example of uh, one one of the example of spontaneous emission such as bulb light so li here light spreads in random directions you can see whereas in case of stimulated emission this is uh, the best example is laser here you can see the light uh goes it is highly directional beam or narrow cone of divergence so you can say there is less divergence as compared to the uh, spontaneous emission this is another difference you can um, uh, write examples as a difference right this is the fourth difference now next difference is that in case of spontaneous emission radiation is a random mixture of quanta having different wavelengths different phase hence a broad spectrum whereas in case of stimulated emission the radiations has same direction same frequency same phase as that of incident radiation right this is the fifth difference and in case of sixth dif difference you just draw the diagram you just show that uh, show this in this case in case of spontaneous emission light is incoherent in nature you can see that uh, the crest of one falls on the trough of another in this case just in some diagrams just see this thing the crest of one falls on the trough of another right this is incoherent light and uh, incoherent light is that example of spontaneous emission whereas coherent light waves for as uh, an example for stimulated emission here you can see the crest falls on the crest and the trough falls on the trough this is coherent light wave right this is the example for stimulated emission six difference thank you very much